little history lesson for you. <laughs> there we go. All right, so now we're talking about those clear skies and the warm temperatures across the central coast for another day. Hard to believe we are in February here. Not exactly record breaking temperatures, but mid afternoon here. Lots of people out and about on the beach enjoying those mid 70 degree temperatures along with those clear skies. Plenty of sunshine out there. Here's a look at Ragged Point. Thanks to Mark Ray and his furry friend uh, doing some hiking out there along with Patty showing us a sunset at Pismo Beach and Mark also showing us the north coast. Definitely a good time to head out and hit the beach, but those temperatures are soon to plummet. Now we're looking at those current conditions at 65 in Santa Barbara, 68 in Gaviota, 74 in Solving, 71 Santa Maria, the low 70s for San Luis Obispo, Paso at 74, Cambria at 66. Those winds are relatively mild in some spots where I guess we mentioned this is a look at the 101 right now. Those clear skies continuing with those offshore winds up to 16 miles per hour in Santa Maria, 14 in San Luis Obispo, 10 in Paso, Lompoc at 13. So relatively gusty conditions in some spots, but those are due to increase. Now tonight as we're looking at that, it's going to stay calm in those overnight hours. And then as we move into Sunday, as that cold front is going to pass through the central coast, we're looking at those uh, mild, those wind gusts up to 25 to 40 miles per hour of sustained winds. And we could see gusts up to 50 or above um, in the next coming days. So those winds due to increase and those cloud coverage as well going to increase. This is a look at Monday night. So this is going to continue for the next couple of days as that cold front is passing through the central coast. Here's a look at what we can expect for those cloud coverage tonight. We can expect those clouds to move back in along with the wind coverage and the possibility of some drizzle, maybe even a mist in some areas. And we're not expecting a whole lot here as we move into Sunday and Monday. Partly cloudy skies. You can see the passing shower here. Most of that going to stay into the Pacific. We're not expecting a whole lot of rainfall here. There is a chance we could squeeze out maybe a trace or two of the, some of that rainfall moving into Tuesday. But if you take a look at more of the long term as we head into early next week, we could see about a tenth of an inch of rain moving into early again next week. So hoping we will see some of that rainfall there. Now the forecast models for tomorrow, we're looking at those temperatures dropping into 67 degrees for Santa Barbara, 64 in Santa Maria and San Luis Obispo is 65. Paso at 61. Those overnight temperatures are also due to decrease by quite a bit. Looking into the 30s in North County, 40s for Carpinteria, Cuyama at 61 for a daytime high, 66 San Ynez, Vandenberg at 73. Now these temperatures, while still relatively warm, are dropping by about 10 degrees from what we saw today, 62 in Pismo Beach and the North Coast looking at 61 degrees. For most of the areas, those daytime highs are going to be in the low 60s. Taking a look at the rest of the week, we're staying nice and cool. Monday going to be the coolest day of all. We're looking at a high of 58 degrees in Santa Maria, Paso 52. Those overnight temperatures dropping into the 20s in the next coming days. San Luis Obispo also going to be seeing those highs in the 50s on Monday, then the low 60s through most of the week. So again, as we mentioned there, a big cool down ahead for us. Scott. Looking forward to it. Some winter weather. Thank you, Kelsey. On celebration of the Winter Olympics, artists across South Korea are coming out to 